gentlemen, welcome back to LSPDFR here in the 2016 Dodge Charger of that pack we've been using. Now, I was going to use the Alameda County Sheriff car over to the right, um, and I'll go. I'll, sh I'll show you what the issue I'm having with it is. You can kind of see it. The yellow on both of those is actually activated, and um, they're kind of steady burn. So I kind of just installed the car and uh, the vehicle... ELS config and uh, unfortunately that's what's happening so I'm definitely going to be using this vehicle if I can get that fixed um, it was going to be th this episode today but unfortunately uh, I wasn't able to get it fixed so we're going to go ahead and get on patrol with this 2016 black and white Dodge Charger actually really sexy I love the light light setup on it it's it's the randomosity that I love so much because it depicts I guess what real police cars would have, not, you know, where people interject all the lights to flash at one time. Just gets a little annoying. So, actually, before I do this, it looks a little... Looks like the time's actually progressing, even though I have it stopped. So, I'm gonna do a nice, gotta love whatever noise that was. <laughs> that does it a lot. It's like it plays a clip of music whenever you fucking, uh, a lot of ACSO cars here. Hopefully, that doesn't come and spawn, uh, when we're doing our patrol because of that ELS glitch we got going on, but, um... Yeah, it's been a while since we've done a Polito Bay Patrol. I can't even remember when we've done it in DOJ lately, so... It's just been a very, very long time. Fucking running, running red lights, starting it off. So yeah, hopefully this will be good. I'm looking forward to a uh, Polito Bay. We'll go ahead and extend the, uh... Yeah, this guy just almost... Okay, what are you doing, dude? Alright, dispatch, show me out. Deleuze Avenue, Polito Boulevard. Uh, with a, uh, Vapid Stan... Sadler? I almost said Stanler. I don't know what the hell that is. Hogged by one time. This guy almost hit, uh, the gentleman back, uh, in the crosswalk there. So I'm gonna go ahead and make contact with the guy, see if, uh, he's alright. See if there's a medical emergency. Hi, sir, stop you, because you almost nailed that guy in the crosswalk. Um, you gotta... Need, a ambulance or anything like that? If not, go ahead and give me your, uh, driver's license. Alright, Henry. Go ahead and sit tight. He's not exhibiting weird behavior or anything. I don't smell anything in the vehicle, so there's nothing really I think we need to be extremely worried about. Um, let's just go ahead and run the guy, see what he's up to. And again, I love this new thing, so I can kind of keep an eye on what the hell is going on. So let's go ahead and run him in the database. Um, Henry Dayland, okay. Valid license, wanted status, none, time stop. So he's good on that aspect. Go ahead and shut that down. I love how much more sophisticated it is. Really nice. We have uh, insurance... Status is expired. Uh, it doesn't give a date on when the expiration actually happened, unfortunately, which would be nice, so that way we can know if it's within two months and we'd actually have to, um, do something about it. But, uh, yeah, since this guy almost hit someone, and he seems to have a pretty bad, uh, record when it comes to driving, we're just gonna go ahead and... Actually, let's see, I think I can go here. Vehicle database. Sadler. Great traffic citation. Gonna be for a Henry Dalen. Uh, that's all of his information. Gonna be a pickup, Sadler. Orientation, equipment. I think it would be under operation. That shit's freaking out a little, but it's all right. Improper passing, no. Arrestable, no. It definitely wasn't an arrestable offense. Um, we'll just do it under careless driving, considering the fact that. Um, yeah, unfortunately, almost, oh shit, almost hit a pedestrian in the crosswalk. There we go. So we're going to add one new citation saved. So we have him in our system. And I accidentally turned my lights on because I did not <laughs> do the whole scroll lock before that. So let's go ahead and get this guy uh, his copy of his citation that we'll write out to him. We just put that in our system. Uh, other than that, I'm gonna let him go. He does have expired registration, but, um... Page up. Right thumb and A. Right thumb... How is someone supposed to do right thumb and A? Get bump. Oh, wow. I handed him this ticket I just wrote. The driver will wait until you are back to your vehicle before taking off. Wow. So they interject on themselves like that now? Oh wow, and it actually pulled off. That is pretty cool. That's an that's a pretty sophisticated system right there, I gotta admit. The fact that I was able to actually type out the ticket 
instead of go to the window and pretend type a ticket out. That was pretty awesome. I gotta admit, that was fucking cool. Wasn't expecting that, and I've had that feature kind of the whole time. So bravo to the uh, creator of uh, Computer Plus. That's pretty awesome. That definitely uh, stepped up the ingenuity into uh, the roleplay there. So we'll be code 4108 off the traffic stop. We're going to continue to look for violations around the city. Right now we got a Warner up there that's tailgating pretty excessively uh, on the Prius that he's kind of behind. So I'm going to go ahead and try to make contact if I can get in front of this. Now they're going back in the turn lane. Just made contact with a truck. Gonna go ahead and try to get them pulled over to the side of the road. Alright, dispatch. Uh, US Route 1, just outside of the city almost. I'm gonna have one stop for uh, careless driving at this time, pretty much. And uh, hit and run. Gonna see what's going on with these guys. Alright, taking off. Dispatch, I got a vehicle pursuit going down US Route 1. It's gonna be occupied two times. Warner, I believe it's blue. I'm really. Shots fired. I got one. Put the fucking gun down. Get off the fucking phone. Get off the fucking phone. Quick, shoot the phone out of their hand. Shot. Ah, I'm getting hit. Suspect still alive. I'm gonna die. Oh. I got fucking murdered. Those were the reinforcements. The AK-47. God damn, dude. Don't die again. Oh, I died again. <laughs> wow. That was, um... That was something else. What the fuck are these calls? Well, <laughs> like... I've never been a part of that one before. Holy shit. I gotta get suited back up. Get back out there. Right now we're getting dispatched out to a store robbery. Polito Bay. Go ahead and try to get down there as quick as I can for the safety of the store owners. All right, dispatch, show me a uh, half a block out. Coming up on scene. I believe we have suspect running. In Palato Bay. Gonna try to tap the suspect to get him to uh, fall down on the ground. Ah, shit. Show me your hands, dude. Get the fuck on the ground. I'm surprised I still have my weapons with the attachments on it. Especially after dying like that. That is pretty surprising. All right, dispatch, I got one in custody at this time. And it looks like they're sending the ACSO units out to uh, transport, which is always good. Unless that's its own... Shit, that's its own little thing right there. All right, they never get out with guns, which is unfortunate because the cops just murder them. And then I get hit by a car. Oh, that's so fantastic, huh? Jesus Christ. All your fault, dude, just saying. Okay, had to turn that off. Let's go ahead and get prisoner transport out. Assistance required for a suspect placed under arrest in, uh... PT is okay. on the way. They're actually, looks like they're arriving on scene. I'm gonna go ahead and just get in my car. Get it off to the side of the road. I guess you can get in my car even though the guy's here to pick you up. That would seem silly. I like how I open the door. He doesn't move, and then I shut the door, and then he finally gets in. Has to open the door himself. What are the fucking motherfucking shit, dude? Alright, take this guy out of the car. I like how he's able to open the door himself, though. Alright, dispatch. We are, uh, code 4 up the store robbery. I'll be, uh, 10 available for calls. Just passed by, and this guy's wielding a knife in his front yard. I don't know what's going on right now, so we're gonna go ahead and turn around. I'm gonna see if I can help this guy. I have no idea what he's doing. Sir, put the knife. He's running. I don't know if there's a victim. Put it on the ground. Shots fired, he took two. Get on the ground and show me your fucking... Shit. Fuck, someone just got hit by a car. Ah, oh, fucking dog, god damn it. It was a dog or a wolf, I'm not exactly sure. And there might be something going on inside, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. I believe there's a victim, but they might be on the roof. I have no idea, I see a green dot. But I have no idea what that means. Yeah, I don't see anything, so... I believe they got away. If there was a victim, I believe they, uh, were able to survive. Unfortunately, we had to shoot down the suspect. I could have... Yeah, no, I did shoot him down there. And unfortunately, a dog was hit by a truck as they were passing. 
Um, so let's go ahead and call corner out. Open that up. And we'll go down to corner. See if we could get... I wonder if they'll treat dogs. That would be pretty interesting. So we'll see what corner has to say. See if they'll be able to treat the suspect that was wielding a knife. I was kind of passing by. And I saw the guy on the porch. I had happened to pull over because I was checking something. And, uh... I saw the guy on the porch. He wasn't aggressive. And then all of a sudden, he started wielding it in a manner that, uh... Would have just been deemed aggressive, I guess you could say. Especially if you're holding a knife. Uh, so then we had a, uh... Unfortunately, open fire on the suspect. Corner's here. They're gonna go out and check this guy. So we'll walk over there really quick and see exactly what their determination is. I think they're actually going for the dog. No. What are you doing? There you go, buddy. Come back. Yeah, they're, they're fucking cornering the dog. Seems legit. Okay, dog has been picked up. Collision of a vehicle. Seems legit. I did not think they picked up dogs like that. At least they picked up the road. At least I'll know that from now on. Okay, and then they're photographing this guy. So, I believe... Well, actually... I should call paramedics first, and then call coroner, because if paramedics can't revive them, then coroner comes and picks them up. So I've done this completely backwards, and he possibly had a chance to live. I didn't shoot him in the face or anything. He definitely took some direct chest sh chest shots. Um, but who knows? Maybe he was 11:44. So I'm gonna go ahead and get back on the road. So dispatch, you could show me code 4108 available for calls. Okay, this guy is shooting at my vehicle. I don't know what he's doing, but he's shooting from the inside of his car and shooting at mine. Shots, I have a shootout with the vehicle. God damn, that smoke is fucking amazing, I gotta admit though. Get the fuck on the ground and drop the fucking weapon. Why did they shoot out with me in the middle of the- Oh, I got him. I clipped him. Get on the fucking ground and drop the weapon. Holy shit. Shots fucking fired. That was the most realistic shootout. Oh, and then his vehicle just got struck. That was fucking insane. Look at the smoke come from the fucking weapon. Bad assery, dude. Bad assery. Yeah, that guy was fucking shots at my car through his fucking windshield. And I was like, oh hell no. I was gonna I was just gonna play it off because I just left that fucking scene. So I wasn't expecting anyone to get riled up, but this guy was starting to shoot through his windshield, so we had to return fire. And then he hid behind his door, which was super legit because then I was able to shoot at his door. But I think with the bullet penetration mod that I put in, one of the bullets might have actually went through the soft metal. And collided with them because I don't think I hit him on any exterior part. I don't remember doing that, but who knows? Let me go ahead and get, uh, let's go ahead and get tow truck out. That was a pretty awesome fucking shootout, though. And I do love this pistol a lot more. It sounds a lot more pop realistic, especially when they're a little far away. You get that real fucking gunshot feel, and then especially if I shoot the weapon as well, um, you just get that really nice pop sound, which is good. I don't know what the gun sounds are, and you guys ask me all the time. I I know that I found them on, like, GTA 5 mods, which I usually only find all my stuff on LSPDFR, but sometimes going out of the box and finding stuff on other sites is a good thing, because LSPDFR doesn't have everything. They usually carry most of everything, vehicles, scripts, and stuff, but not not the whole shebang. Um, but yeah, that, that was pretty good. I gotta rate that one like an 8. That was pretty awesome. Um, alright, I'm gonna get on the road, so dispatch, you can show me code 4108 available for calls. Okay, I have yet in my history of LSPDFR since this mod has been out to take the illegal immigrants in truck because you know why. Um, but since light of all the Trump events, um, we might as well just take a peek at it. I've never done it, so it's brand new to me. It said a license plate 65 and, uh, 65 Nora Tom something. Let me see what the fuck it said. It said 65, uh... Nora Tom Frank 611. That's, it's a Mule 3 suspicious truck. Is a Mule 3 65 Nora Tom Frank. So that's, that's what we're actually, Nora Tom Frank 611. Nora Tom Frank 611. I got one right there. 
I don't know if it was... Ooh, almost hit that curb. Uh, Nora, Tom, Frank, 611, that's gonna be our suspect right here. Don't you do it, you stupid motherfucker. What, what are you, why? Why would you... Oh! <laughs> it just got hit again and bounced into the air like 10 feet. What the fuck? Oh my god. Get out of the way, out of the way. Dispatch, I got the suspect in sight. We're gonna go to make contact with the mule right now. Pull the fucking vehicle over, dude. Yep, they're gonna be taken off. We're gonna have a mule pursuit. That sounds, on so many levels, retarded and just ridiculous, but it's gonna be going down US Route 1. Uh, it's gonna be a white box truck. I have no idea how many occupants there are inside. I have no idea how many occupants there are inside the back, so that kind of limits us on our pitting and everything that we really want to do um, to the vehicle that we would normally do procedure-wise. I can't hear myself think. There we go. I had the microphone part of the headset all the way down to where it's like I've sounded like I'm muted up in this bitch. Uh, but right now, US Route 1 westbound. Uh, I would like to see if I can get a eye on the occupancy occupancy inside the vehicle. It would help to know what I'm dealing with and what level of uh, seriousness, because if they're not stopping, that means that they're going to probably do whatever they can to get away. All right, dispatch, you can show it be occupied one time. Uh, possible occupants in the back, though, so still no unknown occupancy except one driver. That person is dead stop in the middle of the road right now. Out of the vehicle. Get out of the fucking vehicle right now. There you go. Oh, there they go. There they go. I need units. Okay, it's just one. I repeat, it's just one. I said there they go, like 45 are going to hop out of the car and start running. They're going to run right into them. Look at those sheriff units. Have them locked down. That's amazing. Okay, dispatch. We have one in custody at this time. I'll follow me over here. Actually, I got I got ped manager, so I'll just... There we go. See? Grab the guy. You can also grab by T left shift. There we go. Okay, now I'm not losing my mind. I'm gonna try to open this up for traffic. I'm just gonna pull my car on the median up here. There we go. At least traffic is going to kind of open up, except for all the sheriff units that are going to kill everyone right now. Okay, uh, tow truck. I don't believe we have anyone dead. I sure hope not. I believe they got that guy in custody. Can you kill your siren, dude? Like, thank you. Okay, look, there's the other guy down there, clearly in custody. It looked like I just saw, like, saw, like, a gunshot go off down there, and then a dude, like, ran, but thank God. All right, we're, we're good. Tow truck's here to uh, pick up the box truck. I'm gonna go ahead and call prisoner transport out for this guy. That way I get all the way back to jurisdiction because I am far away. Although it's kind of coming to the end of the patrol, but I'll probably do one more call. Okay, we can go ahead and get out of here. I don't know what the tow truck's doing, but we gotta head back. All right, dispatch. I am good to roll. Good to grow. You could show me code four, ten eight, and back to jurisdiction. Thank you. Oh my God! <laughs> oh shit! I have just been seeing so much fucking shit lately. It's not even funny. That was fucking classic as shit. Dispatch calling unit three eighteen twenty four. We have a suspect resisting arrest in Palato Bay. Right now we have a pursuit in progress. Looks like it's actually- what in the fuck? That tow truck just did some hydraulic shit. I don't know what's going on with my game lately. Pretty funny, but uh, pretty weird. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get a route. Damn, lost it on the dirt. <laughs> Straight up lost it on the dirt. Gotta love it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get a route. That's not even the one I want to do. This is this one. Uh, into a pursuit in progress right now. Motorbike that was dirt biking back here. A uh, officer tried to make contact with the suspect. 
Suspect is now fleeing from the officer. Go ahead and see if we can get up there and provide some assistance. I have no idea where they're at. Suspect is under arrest. Son of a bitch, are you kidding me? They are under arrest. That's what I saw. The fuck are you doing? I wanted to be a part of the action. How did that cop get him stopped so quick? What the fuck? Well, there you go. That was your last call. Blame it on this motherfucker. God damn it. You still didn't die from that. Wow. Tough cookie. All right. Well, that's going to do it for this patrol. I really hope you guys enjoyed. We will see you next episode.